Hello and a very good morning to all my dear students. Good morning that because the video is being recorded during morning time, so that's why a very cool morning to all my dear students. My name is Ms. Rashmi Chetri and once again I welcome all the students of class 3 over here. So kids, today we are going to learn, today we are going to read about nest and baby birds from chapter 5. Uh, with following this book, it is Lakhmir Singh Science Book for class 3, okay? But before that, I want to ask you a question. Have you ever thought why do birds build nests? Because birds build nests to lay their eggs. And because nest works as a very safe and cozy place, so that's why bird builds nests to lay their eggs. And they use different materials to build that nest. And after they lay eggs, then what happens? They used to sit on that eggs to keep it warm. Because the warmness of that birds, warmness of that birds, what they do? After, after a while, when birds sits on that egg, then what happens? That eggs hatches out and the baby, small baby comes out. Okay? Because the baby bird cannot fly at once, so what they do? They used to feed the parents, the mama bird, or the mama bird used to feed the baby bird. Okay? As they can't fly at once, as the egg hatches, then what happens? They can't fly, they can't eat, they can't hunt or pray for the food. Then what they do? They wait for the mama bird so that the mama bird brings the food and they feed them. That's why the nest acts as a very safe and a cozy place for the baby birds. So kids, different birds use different materials and they use to build different type of nest according to their height, according to their, to their size. Okay, like birds build their nest with the help of those materials and they are like dry grass, leaves, twigs, cotton and scrap of that cloth and uh, in this way they build their nest okay means different birds has different type of nest all the nests are not same because all birds weaves their all, all the birds different birds make their nest in different ways so like here to have a look at the board like eagles nest eagles nest they build on a high platform they build that nest on a high on the top of the tree so that the parents, the mama bird can see the dangers from far away and they build their nest using huge pile of twigs and sticks. Twigs means like, you might have seen, the twigs are small and they use it, that is called twigs, okay? They use a huge pile of twigs and sticks to build their nest. Taylor birds nest, they use two green leaves. They used to make a, that, they, they used to join the leaves and they used to make a round that type of nest. And then what they do? They pierce this hole on both of the edges. From this side also, from this side also. They used to pierce this hole. And after that, what they do? They used to sew that, sew that edges with the help of spider web. Okay? In this way, eagle, uh, in this way, birds used to build their nest. Then, weaver's bird's nest, weaver has a very conical and a very sharp beak. So what they do is, they use to, means they use that beak, they use that conical beak to build their nest, to take a blade of grass, okay? They used to take that blade of grass and then they used to make a nest. Like you might have seen, you can look at your book also, you will get this in page number 39. You will get this type of image. This they used to build weaver bird. They used to build this type of nest, okay? Because they have a very conical beak and with the help of their legs and their beak, they, they can tie the knots also. Tie the knots in a sense, but the whole uh, have blades of leaves so that they can tie that knots also, okay? In this way, students, different types of birds may make different type of nest okay so now we are going to 
open, we are going to use the book. So everyone open to chapter number 5, it's page number 38, okay? Nest and baby birds. Birds will everyone just have a look at the book, point your finger and read aloud with me, okay? Birds build nest to lay eggs. The nest is a cozy and a safe place for the eggs. After a while, the egg hatch and baby birds come out. Since the baby birds cannot fly at once, the nest acts as a safe shelter for them. And materials for nest building. Now we are going to read materials that the, that the birds use to build their nest. Okay? Nests of birds are varied, as I said to you before only, that different birds make different types of nests. Birds use different materials such as dry grass, leaves, twigs, cotton and scrap of cloth and wool to build nests. Many birds glue their nests together with materials such as spider web, silk and birds. So many of the birds, what they used to do is, they used to build, they used to join their nests with the help of spider web, silk and mud. Okay? Now, birds also like to provide a soft lining inside the nest to make it more comfortable. So, what they do is, for outer part, what they do is, they used to, uh, they use twigs, okay, twigs and like grass. But for that, for laying the eggs, so that the eggs may remain safe and when the baby comes out, so that it may remain in a cozy and a very warm place, what they do, some of the birds uses their own feathers to line up that nest okay for example quills and ducks use their own feather to line their nest but other collects feathers drop by large larger birds okay then now let's move on to page number 39 it's beautiful nest a bird's nest can be simple or can be fancy here are some examples okay Eagle's nest, as I, as I have told you the highlight, I have already given you the highlight of eagle's nest. So, the eagle's nest is a huge pile of twi uh, twigs and sticks lined with leaves in the middle. It is built on a high platform. As I told you that eagle nests are built on a high platform so that the, the parents bird can see the nature for, from far away. This helps the parents see nature from far away. Taylor bird's nest. You can look at the book, okay? See this type of nest they build. That is Taylor's bird nest. This one is Taylor's nest, okay? So what they do is, let's see. The Taylor bird uses one or two large green leaves to build, build its nest in a low bush or a small tree. Just like eagle. As I told you that different birds will build different type of nest. Eagle build their nest in the top of the tree, okay? But this bird, tailor bird used to build their nest in a, uh, means a low bush or in a small tree. It pierces holes, okay? It pierces holes on each leaf side. What do they side They hole on both sides, okay? With the help of their beak. Then what they do? Using its pointed beak as a needle. Then it swims, swims the edges together with spider webs plant fibers or fine grass. Then what they do is they used to sew that edges together with the help of that spider web, plant fibers or a fine grass. An entrance hole is left at the top side. Okay. Then let's read Vivo's bird's nest. What we have learned first thing we have learned that why do birds build their nest and we have also learned the materials they use for building the nest and we have also learned how the eagles and tailors, uh, tailor bird used to build their nest. Now we will see how beaver birds build their nest. Okay? A beaver bird has a strong and a conical beak which, is, which it uses to cut the blades of grass for nest building. Okay? They use the, their means conical beak to take out the to take out the blades of grasses. Okay? It can tie knots in the nest materials with its beak and its feet. This makes the nest 
even more secure. When they tie the knots, na, then what happens? It makes that nest very much more secure and safe. The nest also has a narrow tube-like entrance that opens upside down. It is hard for a predator to get inside the nest through its, uh, through this entrance. Okay? Some of the birds, what they do na, means is if they found there are eggs, okay? If they found some of the birds, if they found that there are eggs, then what they used to do? They used to destroy it and they used to eat it, okay? But for this weaver's bird, they used to make the nest so much with the help of the tying, with the, tying the knots. Then what they do? They make the nest very much, so much strong, so that means other the predators could not catch the uh, eggs and they could not get inside. So now we will see woodpecker's nest. Okay, a woodpecker bores gold into hard tree trunks to make nest. Okay. Then their stout chisel like bills allow them to bore into wood without getting hurt. Their beak are very much means chisel means it is very sharp and pointed and that beak allows that uh, that beak allows the bird to make a to bore a hole into the tree. Okay, tree trunk. So these are the different types of birds and the pictures given out that how do different birds build their nest. Okay. So now let's move on to page number 40. It's nest of some other birds. Human birds build tiny nests and line them up with the spider web. Okay? Some birds like hogs, sparrow, like to nest in a protected hole or cavity. Blackbird use birds to strengthen their nest. Once the main frame of the nest is complete, they line it with feathers, animal hair, and grass. You might have seen on the up, on the above of the of our house or corridor that some of the small birds build their nest there also. Okay, like sparrow, if they get some dark and a hole place, they used to go there and they used to build their nest. So in this way, different birds build their different types of nest. Okay, no nest. Cuckoos do not build any nest. They lay eggs in the nest of other birds. Once the cuckoo cheek hatches, it pushes all the other eggs and cheek out the cheek outs of the nest. Cuckoos, what they do? They don't build any nest. They used to lay their eggs on the other nest. Okay? And taking care of the babies. Birds take good care of their eggs and babies. Before the eggs are ready to hatch, they need to be kept very much warm. As I told you that time only, that uh, the egg needs warmness to be for hatching. Okay, birds sit on the eggs to keep them warm. Once the eggs hatch and the babies are out, the adult bird guards the babies carefully and against all dangers such as bad weather and enemies. As soon as when the baby is too small, then what they are under the guidance of their mama birds. Means mama birds used used to feed the baby. They used to take care of that small baby bird. Then baby birds are not able to fly at once. So adult birds bring food and feed them with their beak. When the babies grow up and learn to fly, the family moves away from the nest. As what happened, children, means when you were born, when you came into the world, that time you were very small and your mama and your papa took care of yours, right? Like they used to feed you, they helped you to walk, they helped you to keep warm and they, they protected you from everything, right? Because you were too small and you all are not capable of handling, protecting yourself. So what they do, what our parents used to do? They used to protect us and they used to take good care of us like feeding and uh, and what happens when you were born, when you were too small, you just used to lie on the bed. Can you walk? No. Similarly here, the baby bird, as soon as the egg hatches, then what happens? They can't fly at once. They can't go far away uh, for food, right? So the parents, the mama bird, she used to bring uh, food, she used to feed them, okay, and she used to protect them. And after the baby 
very brief, after a while, when the baby can, baby bird can fly, then what happens? They all, the entire family, fly away from there and they used to go somewhere else. So kids, today what we have learned in this chapter, first thing that, how, why do birds build nests? Secondly, what type of materials do birds uh, needed to build their nests? And we have also learned that different birds make different type of nests. All the nests are not same. Different birds have different kind of nests. Nest, okay. And we have also learned like eagle's nest, how it looks like, where do they build their nests. And we have also learned the tailor's bird's nest, okay. And lastly, what we have learned and, uh, and what we have learned, weaver's bird's nest. Woodpecker, and we have also uh, learned that some of the birds they don't build their nests. They used to take, their, they used to lay their eggs on different nests. And when the baby hatches out, when the baby birds come out and the egg hatches out, then what happens? They threw all other eggs and they used to take care of their baby bird. Okay, so kids, this was the chapter. I hope that you all uh, have understood all this. Now what you will do is, you will do the reading thoroughly, okay? And in this way, you will read the chapters and develop the reading skill. So now, we are going to proceed with the exercise. So students, open to page number 41 and start writing the answers, okay? We will solve this. First one is objective type questions. Number one, name the words that uses one or two large green leaves to build its nest. The answer will be tailor bird. Number B ties knots in the nest material with its beak and its feet. That is weaver bird. Number C bores holes into the hard tree trunks to make nests. That is woodpecker. Number D builds tiny nests and lines it with spider webs. That is human bird. Number E uses bird to strengthen its nest. That is black birds. Okay? Now number 2 is identify the nest. There are different type of pictures given. So you have to identify uh, which bird's nest is this. Okay. So number A will be weaver birds. Number B will be tailor birds. Number C will be woodpecker. And number D will be eagles. Now move on to question number 3 that is filling the blanks. Birds use different materials such as dry grass, leaves, twigs, cotton and scraps of cloth and wool to build the nets. Number B, some birds provide a soft lining, soft lining inside the nest to make it more comfortable. Number C, an eagle builds its nest on a high platform, platform like a large tree or cliff. Number D, the beaver bird's nest has a narrow tube-like entrance that opens upside down. Number E, human bird tiny nest and line them with spider webs. Next one, number F, cuckoos. Cuckoos lay eggs in the nest of other birds. Number G, birds sit on their eggs to keep them warm. Now turn the page everyone, it's page number 42, question number 4, write true or false. Quills and ducks use their own feathers to line their nest, that is true. Number B, tailor birds build nest on cliffs, that is false. Number C, human bird bore holes into hard tree trunks, trunks to make nest, that is also false. Number D, cuckoos lay eggs in the nest of other birds, that is true. Number E, an eagle's nest has a narrow tube like entrance that open upside down, that is false. Now, this is MCQ, okay, multiple choice questions. Take the correct option. Number A, which of this is not true about the weaver bird? That is, its nest is tiny. Number B, which of this material a bird might use to build its nest? Answer will be all of this. Because they use dry grass also, leaves also and twigs also. Number C, it pierces holes on each leaf edge. Identify the bird, its tailor bird. Number D, before the eggs are ready to hatch, they need to be kept. Warm. Last number, which of this is not false? Adult birds bring food for the baby birds. This is not false, okay? 
now we will do subjective type question for this you will be using your science exercise book okay number a question is why do birds build nests birds build nests to lay eggs the nest is the cozy and safe place for the eggs number 2 what materials do birds use to build nests birds use different materials such as dry grass leaves twigs cotton and scraps of clothes to build nests number 3 why do birds like to provide soft lining inside their nests birds like to provide soft lining inside their nests to make it more comfortable number d how does a beaver bird build its nests a beaver bird has a strong conical beak which it uses to cut blades of grass for nest building it can tie knots in the nest material with its beak and its feet last number how do birds take care of the babies birds take good care of their baby number first is sitting on the eggs to keep them warm birds guard the babies carefully against all dangers they bring food and feed them with their with their beak so here 